Hey everybody, welcome back. We uh, were somewhere for Regina again. My favorite fixer. V, we got data from Jotaro's private server. Found out oh. he's been procuring people for his recordings. Oh, cool. Meet Jay Hume, human trafficker and bona fide piece of shit. Check the sit shop <sighs> for me. Deets attached. So, okay, so. <laughs> This is awesome. So our last job was connected to the uh, transponder that we had to connect to the car. And right before we did that mission, we were investigating Jotaro, the guy that was making these snuff films. And on his computer, we read that he was being supplied um, people by somebody. And it might have even might have even had this person's name, but I don't recall it. Um, anyway, it seems like this is the person. Countless dreamers head to big cities in search of a fresh start, and so many of them have nowhere to t return to. Outcasts, loners, rejects. Jay Hoon's put a target on the backs of those societies failed, and there's no shortage of them in Night City. Here's the rundown on Jay Hoon's meat grinder. He identifies some poor bastard, kidnaps them, and delivers them to scavs for Biomon or other cyberware removal. They're stripped of their identities and end up the property of some shitbag like Jotaro to do with as they please. Of course, no one really looks for these people. And even if they did, where would they start? What are the odds? To find someone in Night City who doesn't exist? Let's face it, Jae Hoon is just one head of the Hydra, but fuck it. Let's chop it off anyways. Could be a good place. Or could be good while, bef while before more grow back in its place. All right. So... Do we want to just... Maybe we just want to kill this guy. Maybe we just want to kill him. Instead of being all delicate. I don't imagine he's going to have a lot of security. Oh, actually, I might be totally wrong. It's just scabs, but... 5C, 1C, BD. 5-5, five, five. okay, can I find a 5-5? Five, five? So if I go 5-5, five, 1-C, five, B-D, that'll work. Uh, oh, yeah. There we go. Hey, look! Increase RAM by one. Oh, sick! Okay, let's do a ping here. Not many. Find Jay Hoon in the restricted parts of the slums. So it looks like these guys aren't going to be too thrilled about us being here. Yeah. No, no, cool. Hey, We're cool. We're cool. Now, why don't you get lost, sweetheart? Yeah, yeah, I'm out of here, man. Okay. I need to find a, a better way over there. Can I jump up top? Not quite. Sorry, gentlemen. Just looking, you know, for like some way around this. I'm going to see if we have access over here. Oh, okay. Let's... Whoa, dude. What the... What is this? Oh, there's a... There's a guard up top. Okay. Let's get a look at this guy again. Uh, do we have to read it in our messages? Okay, little goatee, glasses. Not any of these.
I'm gonna try to get in behind her, I think. She's only catching us out of her periphery. Oh god. Oh god. So that guy sees us. That's a problem. Oh, he actually left. That was the wrong call there. These are the guys at the gate. So if I was a betting man, I would say that the only guy... Well, actually, I'm not even sure. We don't see him at all. Maybe he's not connected somehow. Come with me. He took care of it properly. Dumbass thought he'd get in with the nomad. Oh, there are two. I wonder if he's down below us talking. Oh, what? How'd they find that body? I need that takedown from above. Down. I'm just going to leave them where they are for now. Oh, is this him? I see the, a beard, but... Nope. Hey, motherfucker! You're a bitch! Wait, what? Let's find some info on this guy. See? Yeah. This is it. This is the message that we read on the other one. I know you don't like surprises, so I double-checked their histories. We've read all this. We have a pretty serious complication. The Asian boy reserved for Jotaro had a severe seizure out of nowhere. He's alive, but extremely weak. I very much doubt Jotaro will have any interest in one so fragile. I'd exchange him for the boy already marked for downtown, but... Maybe that throws a wrench in everything. It's your call. Okay, let's do this. We'll make the change. I'll smooth things over with the Corpo downtown. I'd rather do that than risk blowback from Jotaro. So people were scared. Wait. Oh, so this is him. He's got the face thing. Yeah, correct. Hey, motherfucker. You're a bitch. I just, I don't know who this person is up here. Oh boy. <laughs> Man, I hate this Carol portion. Oh, this is the thing for the uh, access points, that icon. Okay, let me clear the rest of this space. Put this down. Crafting spec for Ashura. Is that, what kind of gun is that? Looks legendary. I think we're clear. 
Constantine Ildefon's Battle of the Ballad of the Two Sisters. There once were two sisters, night and death, death large and night small. Night had the beauty of dreams, while death, death was most lovely of all. Hey noni noni, hey noni noni, death, death was most lovely of all. Hey, motherfucker, you're a bitch. Oh, weird. Whoa, we got a smart weapon. They require a smart link to unlock the full potential to install and be sure to visit your trusty Ripper dock. Smart link I'm still unsure about. Okay, I'm gonna set this guy here for right now. What the need? <laughs> we'll suspend a bit of disbelief on that one. To, like jump you? off of something with him let's see if this gets both of them I only want to talk promise <laughs> He's coming around. And sleep. Wait, <laughs> All right. See you later, buddy. I enjoy that just a little too much. E9. Do I have an E9? I do not. Uh, we can do E9, 5, 5. So let's go here. Hey, motherfucker. You're a bitch. Oh, what the? F I'm going to short circuit this. Insufficient RAM is going to take a second. What? Let's run. I can't run. I can't heal while I'm carrying this either. I'm hoping we're far enough away from that side. Hey, motherfucker, you're a bitch. We'll see who the bitch is. I wonder if there's something uh, that increases our speed while carrying bodies. See you later. Another asshole shoved in a trunk where he belongs. Yeah, well deserved. Nicely, nicely done. Closing the gate. See, what's cool about this now, we put both of them, we put Jotaro and we put him in the trunk. I'm really hoping that at some point 
we actually end up hearing some kind of update from them about uh, what has happened to these guys, that would be really interesting. Okay, so we're like, we're pretty much in the clear here. Um, I think what we'll do is I'm going to actually head to this weapon shop. Man, I hate this cowardly horse shit. I want to see if we can get a, um, a scope for our gun, for our sniper rifle. Nice. Uh, are we still tracking? Yeah, it looks like we are. Watch it! Those crosswalk beeps are very, uh, obvious, let's say. Oh, and look, he was so close to the ho- oh, very convenient. Very convenient. take care of an assault after if we have time. Boo! Sorry about that. Yeah, my bad. That's all on me. Very nice. Very nice. Services, please. So we're pretty well clear on everything. Uh, these are all, these are both waiting. Cycle Killer is probably just like the random question marks and stuff. So yeah, I feel pretty good about where we're at. I feel like a lot of people would probably have gone to this, um, to this afterlife place a lot sooner, but I like to just approach these things as organically as possible. And if there's stuff on the way that we could be doing, then great. If it's a big rush, then we would obviously go there, but it doesn't seem like it was necessarily a huge rush. really high up here hey let's see what you got all right let's see what you got what i like to hear yeah i bet okay so i want to look at attachments and more specifically i want like a scope holographic sight do i have to get a specific here's a standard issue sniper scope Designed by Militech, guarantees reliability, extreme range, adds some range as well. A long scope, lacking advanced features, but does include an ammo counter attached to the left side. Simple but effective. Um, okay. Grandstand long scope with digitally enhanced targeting systems. Most effective in conditions with low visibility. And then we have holographic long scope developed by the Arasaka Corporation, precise and unobtrusive. So holographic is not going to help us. So I think, I don't know if, if long scope would be the same type of thing. I want to say yes. 0.63 extra range there. Let's buy this. And let's see if we can throw that on. Only one way to find out. And no. Okay. So it has to be specifically... Uh, Oh, the Assure is a, it's a smart sniper rifle. Smart link cyberware required. And level 9. Alright. I'm back. I need... Uh, I bought the wrong thing. There we go. So now we know.
<laughs> now, if only we could reduce, like, weapon sway and stuff, which we probably can if we spec into the right area. Understood. Got it. Sure. Hey, wait a sec. Oh, he's, uh, he sells, uh, melee stuff. That's what he does. Thought maybe this was... Wait. Oh! Wait. Where are we here? Oh, cool. Okay, so this is the same, uh... Yeah, I got confused. I understand. Nature comes this was the guy that hooked us up at the beginning. We came in such a different way, I didn't realize. We bring you milk quality that even Mother Nature can. How you doing? Hey, wait, don't go! About those fights you mentioned. V, V, V! If you don't have a titanium skull lining, you're gonna have memory problems in no time. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Yeah, you'll Crystal. see us at the top. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kabuki. I know I believe in you. Absolutely. Time no, to no, show this city like what you made of. I mean, shit, he was in uniform. Dr. Havoc and Radon. Uh, the battery sphere is in dire straits. The Irinians have occupied almost half the city. Them and their Technorat scourge have transformed almost everyone into hordes of mindless zombies. Battery Arena is now the final point of resistance against the invaders from Planet X. It seems the end is inevitable. Okay, so this is fiction, I think. That is, until the legendary mercenary pair arrive just in the nick of time after years of mysterious absence. Amidst the cigar smoke and glint of chrome armor, Dr. Havoc and Radon slaughter scores of enemies without mercy. After all, who could possibly slow the mighty force of a laser-armed mountain of muscle and his spitfire of a sidekick who can transform into a sentient cloud of radioactive gas? I'll tell you. No one so far. Rose, Tenorio, and Martoni Elazor take us into the world of computer games first imagined in the bestseller novel Kibble and Scop by Abe Frost. Fasten your seatbelts and get ready for a roller coaster ride of a comic book of comic book violence. If you ever wondered what the action of the battery arena may have looked like, Dr. Havoc and Raiden is a must buy. Dive in now. All right. All right. That even Mother Nature can Got it. Undocumented sure. animal will increase to forty thousand euro dollars. Thank you for tuning in to the M54 local news. Have a pleasant day. I wish I would have caught the beginning of that when she said something about forty thousand dollars, because I'd be about it. Uh, yeah, that's cool that we came in there from a different area. We and we have actually come down through here before, uh, when we were originally coming to meet Jackie, I believe, when he's eating his noodles. Cirrus Cola. That must be the mascot, this bird. Yeah, see, we were chilling here with him. Cool. All right, so NCPD right next to us. I'm just trying to take in this area. To buy in foods. All right. Oh! <laughs> I was reading the signs. My bad. No, that was intentional. Hey, yo, uh, gang members. Or cops, whatever. All right, never mind. Do your thing. It's gonna give somebody a free vehicle. Yo, Jackie. Damn, about time, Holmes. Yeah, how's Mama Wells? What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Can't help Whatever. Yourself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. 
more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! Hey, afterlife's known far and wide. The afterlife. Known far and wide, that name. Oh, yeah? Some of the Nomad Clan's biggest jobs are scored right here. Don't surprise me. Ain't no better place than Night City to land a gig. So I've heard. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. When proper burials were still a thing. And who might you clowns be? Hey, Simmer. Uh, do we need to drop the Dexter bomb? Yeah, sure. We're friends of Dexter Deshaun. He's expecting us. Yo, Dex, got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Emmerich, hey, is it? Hey, you, you Talk to you later. So cool. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All sat on those floors. Fell asleep on that same bar. Looks like we're up. Hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Which one are we talking Our about? Dex was the best. Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> oh, hello. Place belongs to her. What can I get you? Uh, Jackie, you pick for me. You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. You will have Johnny Silverhands coming up. Oh, cool. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Traditions. Drinks are named after our regulars. What do you have to do to get your own drink? Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? It's nothing. Mind-blowingly spectacular fashion. Knit up would be best. Uh, what a beautiful tradition. <laughs> uh, the Night City. Actually, no. To getting filthy rich. That's Remember back at the beginning, we're talking about some of uh, V's motivations. And... Uh, kind of admir admiring those wealthy people, but hating the corporate lifestyle you need to get there. Yeah, to getting filthy rich. Being filthy rich. Filthy rich legends. There you go. Who else got honored in that way? Who else can I drink here? All on the menu. Except there's a spot missing. Morgan Blackhand, right? <laughs> it's true. Morgan's yet to make up his mind if he's dead or still kicking. <laughs> Nobody knows what happened to him. Think he's still alive? It's been years. Why not? Look at Rogue. Peaked from that era, a species unto themselves. Hmm. Guess there's no such thing as actual living legends then. Just dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. <laughs> you want to write down my recipe? Hmm, <laughs> sure. Oh, cool. Do Shot it. of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer. Oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Is Dex a regular? Sean, see you now. Yeah, one second. Takes a regular. You come here a lot. A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. 
guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. How'd you know? How'd you know? My job to know. Look around. How do you think mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Claire Russell. All right. Good Mr. chat. Dishon, no yeah, Thanks. I got you, Hustle. Let's go. This way. I'm trying to see who they were talking about. I feel like it's... Maybe it's her? Damn, Holmes. You're huge. Work out? Mm. Same here. <laughs> no, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? Mm. Think you could take me? Drop me? In here. This pinche tipo. This guy's all business. Oh, I'll get it. That's right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Mr. V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Let's see this bad boy. Where is this? Can I just take this? Oh, put flathead in the briefcase. Okay. I Looks like we got a suit. Set your butts down comfy. Yo, T-Bug, thanks for your help with the scabs. Thanks for your help back at the scab haunt. A few reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Looks more like now, a recording now. booth. Mr. Wells is right. We're going to be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Uh, pretty well, actually. I don't want to throw her under the bus just yet, but we saw Compeki Plaza from the inside. Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza inside from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target? Yorinobu Arisaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? Yeah, something like that. So she just want to see what's good or was there something else? No, something's definitely weird. Um, Parker chick. She's she's know. different. Sent out mixed signals, so I got mixed feelings. One night sipping champ paradise with Yorinobu. Next night chatting it up with regulars at Lizzie's. Worlds don't match up. Struck me too. You saying we putting two and two together and getting five? Some <laughs> part of the equation's missing then. Something like Clearly. that. That's why y'all gotta fix her. Anyone try to fuck you? They first gotta fuck their way through Dex to Sean's 300 pound ass. Okay, I'll remember Anything that. Anything else? Uh, frick. I'm trying to think like, is there a possibility that, cause we told her that we're not into it, right? I just don't want him to go at some point being like, hey man, you should have told me. I think she just wanted to see what I was about. Wanted to see what she was about, huh? How about we go over the plan? Mm. What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Because here's the thing. We're still we building loyalty with Dex, you. too. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. But Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, okay. with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. It goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Cool. Um, I mean, 
if there's not going to be a lot of security, then it should be pretty straightforward. But clearly something's going to go wrong. How do we get into the penthouse? How do go we get in the penthouse? Your Nobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Konpeki's dweller. Elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Oh. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Oh, hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Is that Trust the bot? I say whatever hit you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. Yeah, cool. Okay. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. <laughs> flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? Yeah, what kind of cover you get us? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. <laughs> what do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Okay. Anything else? Uh, so Delamain's our ride there and back. Transports a Delamain. I don't know what a Delamain is. Brand company in all night city. Not a oh. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. So they're like professional yeah, drivers. Yeah, creepy nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B. In oh. Style. And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. Delamain's an AI. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is the No Tell Motel. Quiet, hey. no questions asked. Okay. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? I think that's it. Okay. Feel brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Cut for fresh talent's always the same. Non-negotiable. 30%. Bro, 30. <laughs> Every part in this drama carries its risks. That's the value of yours as determined by me. All right, easy for you to say. It, it seems low. Come on, Dex. Isn't that a little low? Hey, hold on, Holmes. Who got the flathead? Yeah. Who pulled the intel from the brain dance? And we're going in a hotel full of soccer men to swipe some fucking toy from the boss's son. We are the job. Hmm. And who's providing transport? A top tier net runner and a lead proof plan and intel? You sure you want to go down this road? <laughs> okay. Like, he makes a fair point, but. Um. We do still want more. Like, we, we handle all uh, the Mr. risk B. here. Yeah, I'm thinking Dexter. Ah. Uh. All right, let's, let's back up, Jackie. Jack's right, Dex. We ought to get more than 30. We deserve more. Fine. 35. Huh. And that's my final offer. Holy crap. I can live with that. It's my final offer, too. Hmm. Been a while since I got a run for my Eddie. <laughs> I actually got a fun. That's awesome, man. Last thing. Kempeki's got a strict no-iron policy. Security gates. The works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part too. Okay, that's the oh. suit we picked up. Got it. Thanks, D. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? When we come out alive. It all depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week, two tops, is my guess. And what do we do while we sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, because old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now, yeah. as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet. So don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta 2. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues, now's your chance. So, what's the deal with you and Dex? You and Dex know each other a while. Um, why? I'm trying to assess how yeah, screwed know. I am. People say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophizing. 
No wonder you get along. I'm sorry, T-Bug. Are we boring you? Plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. Hmm. All right. I think we're clear. I'm good. No questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Uh, something I gotta take care of first. Let's see. Something I just wanna I gotta take care of read first. this thing on the table. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. All right, brother. Oh, perfect. Delamain Transport Services. Delamain, need to be on time for an important meeting. Don't want your valuable tech to fall into the wrong hands. Or maybe you just don't like crowds. With Delamain, you leave the problems at the door. Our corporate transport service has a fleet of over 20 armored cars ready and waiting to bring you to your destination in comfort and security. We guarantee the following. Secure transport for individuals and packages in the Night City area. Quality that goes hand in hand with speed. Uh, professional customer service specifications to suit even the most demanding clients discounts for loyalty members they say that most accidents happen in the home they're wrong do you know that over 82 percent of crimes and accidents happen on the streets thanks to delamain you'll never have to worry about statistics again our clients comfort and security is our number one priority we hold all safety requirement certificates we don't ask questions there's no sound more beautiful than the symphony of hostile bullets bouncing off our armored windows try the excelsior package and enjoy our maximum security option safety is the one luxury you can't afford so what are you waiting for order a delamain today delamain leave your problems at the door just don't forget to suit up put on the militech suit this is gonna be sick all right guys we're going this is going to be big. Wish us luck. We're going to need it. We'll see you soon. Bye for now.